Hello everyone, my name is the Ember Knight, or Emma for short. Welcome back to the channel, and today we are doing a different kind of video today. Um, as you can see in the bottom right, um, we've got some Fortnite gameplay. Um, but I wanted to try out this new, like, this new way of doing videos. Um, just to like start like a little, a new playlist on the channel. Um, me just talking about my thoughts about the channel and whatnot. But um, today... I thought the first video for me to talk to you guys about would be my top 10, top 10 favorite, top top 10 ranked games that I've played in, on the channel. These are just 10 random ones I picked out. Um, I've numbered them 10 to 1, 10 being the worst, 1 being the best. So we're just going to get straight into it. And at number 10, we have Shame Legacy. Um, Obviously, if you've seen that video, you'll know how much I hated it. Trying to get rid No. Um, the main reason I didn't like it was the AI was horrible. Um, the voices just, oh, they pissed me off. I'll even put, like, clips right now as I'm talking about it to show you what it was like. Um... Just that, we miss you, William. He's over here. I found him. Like, all of that, just, ooh. I don't really want to punch that faces. God damn it. Okay. I'm going to cut that out. Possibly, I'll try. Um, well, actually, ignore what just happened there. I'm sorry that um, I'm using Infliction as like a main menu screen to talk because like I'm using the PS5 camera, but that doesn't matter. Um, on to the next game, which will be Dead Island 2. Um, as much as I enjoyed Dead Island 2, it's a great game. I'm not saying it's a bad game. I just thought the gameplay that I did wasn't too good. I mean, I did it with Adam. Um, me and Adam aren't friends anymore. Um, I'm not going to go into that on why we aren't. Um, it's it's just the way life is. You lose friends and whatnot. Um, but yeah, just the... It was weird because like we were just like speeding through the story in a way and like all we were doing was just killing zombies. I wanted to talk a bit more, but I didn't know how to because it was like one of the, like, um, it's just the type of game it is. You know what, what this need. acid needs? What? A little bit of water. Over there. Right. Needs a bit of me. Mmm, acid. <laughs> oh shit, I'm burning. It's a bit weird to talk about it. Um, and then for number eight, we have Christmas Massacre. Um, sorry, this was like, this was the first video I did on the channel. Um, well, I'll say it's the first. The first is actually something else, but I'll go into that in like a different episode of like me talking. Um, Christmas Massacre was the first game I ever played. Uh, I really enjoyed it. It was absolutely brilliant. Uh, I mean, yeah, I don't know what to say about it. Like, I played it in January, like a little bit after after December, so it was a little weird playing it right about that time. But overall, absolutely amazing game. Um, I would love to revisit it sometime because. Back then, I called myself Psycho Tyrant. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Christmas Massacre. Um, didn't have a face cam. Didn't have an intro or anything. But I enjoyed that one. Up next is Absolute End of Gods. Um, this was when I started, like, doing proper, like, proper thumbnails. Like, I was really, like... That's when I like found out um, something called Adobe Express. I mean, I was using Adobe Express for Christmas Massacre, but 
Um, I got access. I bought the like the subscription. I still use it to this day. Um, and that's when I started making my thumbnails. I had a lot of fun playing Absolov. Uh, again, great game. Um, not much to say about it other than. I would love to check it out again, maybe like in the future of the channel, do a little revisit of it. Um, I mean, the monster designs were perfect. I loved everything about it. But that is Absolov. Number six, um, we have Grounded, which I also did with Adam. Um, we never finished it. <sighs> I loved Grounded. I mean... The idea of being small in a garden is just brilliant. Um, the spiders, or as I like to call them, eight legged spooky boys, terrifying, especially the wolf spiders. Like getting chased by them, the screams, like, were funny. Are you talking, are you talking to the spider? <laughs> Walk away, maybe. No. Oh, you right there. And who can forget little lol jelly bean? Uh, I miss Jelly Bean. Honestly, I was gonna get a tie with Jelly Bean just because of like how much uh, I had like a, a connection to, to that like character. Uh, even though it wasn't a character, it was just a random petty can tame in a random game. Um, I don't know. I just felt so connected to Jelly Bean. I, I loved him or her. Uh, I got so sad when she just disappeared once and like clipped through the ground. But that was number six. Now on to number five, we have Outlast 2. Um, I wasn't sure where to put this one, so I put it at like the middle because it's definitely better than Shame Legacy. Um, if you want to, if you want to play just Shame Legacy, I would say just play Outlast 2 or the Outlast series. Brilliant series. Uh, Outlast 2 was just terrifying it was my first time playing it i mean i tried to play it back in the day on game pass i think it, it was on um i could be wrong about that but then i i got the playstation i turned it was on playstation i was like you know what screw it i'm started recording i'm gonna record outlast 2 and really enjoyed that had a lot of good clips from it and i'll probably put some like gameplay of these videos just to show a bit um Next up we have Reveal, or Reveal, 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 Rev, Reveal, um, the clown game, that was a lot of fun, uh, good little survival horror game, would love to play it again, because I never platinumed it, I planned on platinum it, but I never got round to it, um, apparently there's like four endings I believe, uh, I'm not going to go into detail on what Revile is about because I don't want to spoil these games for you guys in case you want to watch them. I mean, I'll leave links in, in the description of all of these um, playlists. Um, great game. Um, and the, the soundtrack, um, this one, I'll put up the picture of the Spotify, the Spotify song. Um, played it in the car and whatnot and absolutely loved it. Um, but that is Revile. And for number three, going to the top three now, we have The Bridge Curse Road to Salvation. This game I absolutely loved. I mean, the monster design, the scares, especially at the end, just getting chased and like panicking was just, ooh, I love that. Um, I know Bridge Curse Roads to Salvation 2 is on PlayStation now. Um, hopefully going to get that at some point in the next uh, couple of weeks because I would love to record that. But yeah, I don't know what else I can say about Bridge Curse other than it's a great game. The monster designs are beautiful. And um, I don't like the woman with the long hair. I mean, she looks cool, but fuck you <laughs> scared as a lot but for number two we have a vr game i think the only vr game other than dentist 
but this is like the only VR game series, I'm pretty sure, which would be The Walking Dead Saints and Sinners. Um, I loved it. I mean, it was like my first VR game that I played um, back when I got the Meta Quest 1. I fell in love with it. Um, I played it like for so many hours. Um, I even played it to the point that, well, this was on the Meta Quest 1, I felt so ill playing it. Like, I know they say, oh, take two hours breaks. They even say that when you when you boot up the Matter Quest for the first time. Make sure to take two hours breaks in between, like, the things or somewhere. And I didn't do that, and I was walking through the garden area, like, um, next to where the building is, where you flood the reserve or you open the res- You either flood the reserve or you finger the reserve. Sorry, spoilers to walk a dead since sinners. But um, I got there and I just felt so ill that while I had a VR headset and I was just like, I'm going to go to sleep now. <laughs> I just lay on my parents' bed because I was playing in my parents' room because I didn't have a big enough room to play it in. And I just wanted somewhere to like, be away from everyone. Um, and then... For number one, my favourite game series that I've done on the channel is... Oh, sorry, wait. Uh, one other thing about Walking Dead Sin Sinners is Larry. That's why I put it number two. Larry, I love you. Uh, I know there's like multiple zombies that look like Larry, but Larry will always be the one. The one walker I will always miss. And I would love to record Walking Dead Sin Sinners too, even though I've played it. But number one is Outlast Trials, which again, with Adam, uh, loved it. I, I honestly, top game. I they, they took the formula from the first and second game, made it into a multiplayer game with multiple objectives. I love that concept. Um, I would highly recommend, if you haven't, give Outlast a go. I mean, phenomenal game. Get your friends to play it with you. It's so scary with friends. And so much more funny because, like, um, I remember there's this one scene. I'll put up, I'll put up the video right now. I like screamed and that, um, so bad. Open the oh door. shit! Open the door! Oh. <laughs> Go! Joy, run, Joy, run, run, Joy, run past the Joy, run, 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 run. Terrible. Um. Sorry. Uh. The amazing, not, not sure what else I can say again, it's an amazing game, Outlast Trials, I would love to record the new, the new killer, um, Bambino, I've heard he's got a gun, which, um, who, who thought at um, Red Barrel that that would be a good idea? Uh, yeah, I don't know what else to say about Outlast Trials, other than I will be recording it again. Um, sadly by myself, unless of course I can get my partner to play it with me, um, but who knows if that'll ever happen. <laughs> um, but that concludes the 10 games that I thought to include in the channel. Obviously there's like more series I've done, I just pan picked these quickly. Um, maybe I could have switched out like, um, Absolute End of Gods for Bridge. Sorry, not Bridge Curse. Um, I get the I get these two confused. Um, White Deer, which I do have the second one, and I would love to record that at some point as well. I've got so many games to record. Um, but yeah, that has been my top ten rankings of the games I've played on the channel. Uh, I know this is like a different formula of video, and we have still got the Fortnite like thing playing in the bottom right. I'm assuming, unless of course it's switched to a different game mode, um, or switched to a different game, depending on how long this this um, video is. Um, I just wanted to do this because I don't want these like talks to affect my other videos, because like Nightfall, as I said, Escape the Glitch 2 and 1. Um, a few of the games I've played, I've ended up just talking about random stuff. 
they're not actually focusing on the game and i feel terrible for that so i wanted to start making these videos i was sitting in bed last night and i was like hmm what could i make a video how could i make my thoughts into a video and i just thought have a little like thing playing in the background like some people use subway freaking servers um i'll just use fortnite or whatever games i'm playing at the time and just talk about um random stuff so thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed my little rant don't forget to like and subscribe because i will be posting more of these um even if it doesn't even if this video doesn't do successful i still want to do these because so i can just get my thoughts out and whatnot but I hope to see you in the next video that I do. Goodbye.